Good morning, Reefers. I'm Daniel. This is Coralust, and this is your follow-up on the Predator Tank. I know it's been a few days. We have been just swamped at the store, and I haven't had two seconds to take a video for you guys uh, and publish them. So that's one of the reasons why we love the Patreon supporters, because that does help us hire other people and get more content out for you guys regularly. So feel free to look into that, Patreon supporters. Um, and all right. So this is the Predator Tank. There's our Stingray. He's absolutely incredible. He's doing pretty well and he wants me to feed him right now, which as soon as I get to the glass, I swear they know I'm here and they just want to get fed. So this is our Blue Line Trigger, who's absolutely stunning. We have the Zebra Moray, who is very curious and is always swimming around the tank and I'm super excited all the time to see him do that. So they seem like a happy bunch at the moment. And there is a shark back there. And I can't wait to show you guys that. So let's go check it out. So we got the puffer. Man, this Moray, anywhere I go in the tank, I swear he follows me around. He's so cool. Uh, he let me pick him up when we put him in the tank, which was pretty nice. So, it's nice to know he's handleable. But, here is our little shark friend over here. Everybody here seems to be um, anxious to get in front of the camera. But the shark tends to just chill. He'll hide most of the day until I put food in. But the second I put in some food, he will be all over the place. Uh, but he's absolutely incredible to look at so I'll have to get some better footage of him later but for now I have something very very, very special I want to show you guys I've been holding out for a while so let's go check it out what that is all right guys here we are in the workshop this is where all the magic happens so one of the things that we've been working on lately is a special project for the Renaissance Academy School. I do have a special update video which I will do for them later on. I just been like I said swamped getting ready for Philadelphia Splash. So Philly Splash is coming up this weekend and we are super super excited to be there and hopefully all will go well and our displays will be ready in time. So let me get to the video for today and I'll talk about this. Um, this is the castle tank so we are sculpting it and painting it still everything in here is custom built and made from recycled parts which is pretty amazing so um, this is just a quick demo tour i haven't put on the um, locks yet but it opens up we're going to have a sump this is going to be a fresh water tank but it is going to have a sump that way the water the evap won't be as much of a problem and we can have an ato system if necessary but this is a castle, it looks incredible. You can see how the stone looks all around. That's the top. We got the gussets, we got all kinds of beautiful craftsmanship here. And we are still painting this. So you can see that I've only done about three out of the six different shades of gray. So I'm trying to make it look absolutely, absolutely incredible. So running out of time, so I, I don't get as much to do as I want to on this. I could literally spend years but we've only had a couple days to sand it, paint it, prep it, and get it ready. So, like I said, Philly Splash came up a lot faster than I thought. Running the new store um, doesn't really leave me much time. So, but when I say I'm gonna do something, I try to do it, and this is pretty awesome. Pretty much what I expected uh, when I said I was gonna make him a cool, kick-ass tank. Um, yeah, so, and this was done with help, so, well, like I said, you guys will see the update in the video later on. This is just a quick, quick, quick tour, but I will like finish prepping everything out once I finish painting. Um, this is just me being creative at the moment and, like I said, doing the multiple shades of gray. So I have to keep painting in between shading and stuff and blah, blah, blah. But you guys can see the vision here and what it's supposed to look like when I'm done. But this is the castle tank and... There you go. So look for us at Philly Splash. Uh, we do have an awesome chameleon visiting us today. 
Um, Ed brought over the female veiled chameleon, and you wouldn't believe what happened um, <laughs> when we put them together. So you guys are probably going to want to see that as well. So let me know in the comments below what you think. As always, thanks for watching and happy reefing. Stay tuned for more.